Greetings, it's Jonathan, a.k.a. Senor Smoke, here at the Ring of Fire in Westchester County, and uh, I want to introduce you to a little friend of mine. This is the uh, Four Pizze Outdoor wood-burning oven from a company, a uh, northern Italian company, by the name of Alpha, A-L-F-A. And notice how when I made the introduction and called it a pizza oven. I think by calling it a pizza oven would be a disservice because this does a hell of a lot more than churn out delicious pizzas, which it does. But to me, um, I think it's more functional uh, as a, um, a vehicle to make, like say for example, I'm thinking of a cast iron skillet loaded with a two and a half inch thick ribeye, uh, seasoned with nothing but salt, pepper, and then wood smoke. Uh, yeah, I'm looking for that medium rare edge to edge pinkness coming out of there in about seven minutes. Uh, or we could do a cast iron skillet again, say with a whole roasted chicken sitting on a bed of uh, sausage, peppers and onions, chicken scarpiello, rock and roll. Um, so if you, you can follow me over here, there's this thing that does a hell of a lot more than just make pizza. Now, the thing that I encounter when talking to folks about outdoor ovens or pizza ovens that burn wood, it's usually if there is a, um, a degree of trepidation about getting involved with something like this, it's the startup time. I don't have an hour and a half to get the coals, get the wood going, and you know, manage it, et cetera, et cetera. And the cool thing about this company is that the startup time has been truncated significantly, and that's because of the way they position their flue and some other interesting things they have going on in the inside of the oven, um, uh, which I can get into at another time. But I have cooked on it myself, and here's where I see the times on the average uh, startup times falling. If we're gonna do cast iron cooking, okay, um, steak, chicken, etc. We did a lamb, an Easter lamb here. I'm ready to cook in about 15 minutes. What I do, put the wood in there, put a fire starter, and then I break out the trusty loof lighters. You can see in this video right over here. And this bad boy is ready to rock in about 15 minutes, okay? And I'm talking 15 minutes to start cooking. Ignition time by using the loof lighter and the fire starters is probably more like five to seven minutes. Now, if you're going to make pizza, that is going to require the uh, refractory bricks that are in here to be very, very hot. So what we found is that you need about 45 minutes, which while it is a longer period of time, it is still shorter than most other pizza ovens that are on the market that require, I'd say, a minimum of an hour, more averaging around an hour and a half to get started. So still, you are saving time, and this has a far more robust build. The design integrity of this is better than anything else that I've seen on the market that burns wood. So um, kudos to the folks at Alpha for churning this product out. We have sold a number of these this spring and summer, and I'm getting nothing but this from customers. So we're gonna do a much deeper dive into this product, um, uh, especially as we kind of turn the page this summer going to the fall because to me there's nothing better than cooking breads, cooking again the cast iron skillet type of uh, recipes with that crisp fall air, very cold libation at hand and that wood just burning in there. I mean I'm just totally stoked about doing that this fall and this winter. So there's gonna be a series of alpha videos coming up from Senor Smoke. But um, right off the bat we just want to ease the uneasiness that some customers have when they see something like this and they're like wood gonna take too long nonsense not with the alpha oven folks Jonathan send your smoke come visit us here at the ring of fire if you're in the tri-state area definitely worth a visit and to all my friends across the country who are barbecue enthusiasts outdoor cooking enthusiasts if you're coming into New York on business come stop by call me up make an appointment hang out we got a lot of very, very interesting, esoteric, eclectic things in this store that you're not going to find anywhere else. And we'll make the barbecue enthusiast in your home, if it's not you, smile. Folks, thank you very much.